about the TB test is that you get it one day, and this is different than most other tests that you get, that you actually have to come back two to three days later. And do you remember what it would look like if you had TB infection? What would the result look like? Um, there'll be a bump. Okay. And they'll measure it with the ruler. Does anyone remember how big it's going to be? How big is it about? Do you remember? It's like that big. Okay, yeah, that's it. So if it's that big or bigger, then it's a positive test. It means you have TB infection. You guys are brilliant. If you have a positive skin test, um, we will send you to um, to have a chest x-ray. We already said you're not sick when you have TB infection. TB infection? Feel normal. You only get sick if you have the TB disease. Um, and you don't know that you have it unless you have the TB test. Okay, and, and what's, what's happening with the TB germ when you have TB infection? What's happening inside your body again? You breathe it in then It'll stay in there, you won't be sick or anything, you can't spread the germ when it's in its wall and you'll just be normal and stuff and that you won't have to worry about it, but you have to stay healthy. Now, can you take medicine to treat TB infection? Can you take medicine to treat a TB infection? Yes, you can. And how many pills do you take to treat TB infection? Medicine, if you have an infection, you should probably take one a day for maybe a, hmm, nine months. Yep, one pill for TB infection. One pill for a whole school year, every day. What are some of the things that make the wall around the TB germ strong? Exercising, eating good food, and sleeping well, getting a lot of sleep. <laughs> you. Exercising on a tre on that treadmill there that I made and popping up stop popping the pills in your mouth to help make the wall stronger. Oranges, bananas, pears, apples and vegetables. You, you eat well, you take the medicine, exercise. you get exercise, and what other thing can you do to keep strong the wall strong? Lots of rest. Thank you. Sleep at night. Gets lots of sleep. So those are four things you can do to keep the wall strong. And that way, the germ isn't going to break out and make you sick. What are some of the things that could break down the wall around the TB germ? Junk food. Okay, junk food. What else? Another disease. Yeah, another disease. That's right. What happens to the wall around the TB germ when a person gets the TB disease? Um, it's all the germs are escaping and they're all, those green things are all the little baby germs and that's the big black germ and they're all escaping and making her sick. Kylie, what happens to the wall around the TV germ when you get sick with TV? It breaks down. Oh, breaks down. Okay. And that's really important, the difference between TB disease and TB infection. So when TB infection right? And then when the wall breaks down, then you get sick with TB disease. Do you feel sick when you have the TB disease? Yeah. What are the symptoms of the TB disease? Uh, Felix. Night sweats. Okay. Anything else? Sleepiness. Sleepiness? Okay. Weight loss. Okay, weight loss. Yeah, that's a really important one. The weight loss is coughing up blood. Thank you. Stan. Um chest pain. Chest pain? Very good. And what about coughing for two weeks or more? Coughing for two weeks or more. So you get a cough for two weeks or longer and it doesn't go away. So it's a blast. If somebody um, in your family has those symptoms, what do you think you'll tell them to do? And maybe you tell them to go get checked for tuberculosis, to go see their doctor or nurse. Because now, 
you might know more than all of the adults in the community about TB and you can remind them about it and that they should go get checked for TB. Can TB be cured? Yes, it can. Can TB disease be cured? Yes. 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 How many pills do you have to take when you have TB disease? Um, there's like 9 to 12 Wait. for an adult, and That's then 5 to 10 for a kid a day. A day. That's it. <laughs> Someone has active TB, we, we treat them with medication, send them for regular chest x-rays. Now we could, you know, treat them in their homes and um, that's way, you know, that's way better for, for the people now.